Hello everyone, welcome back to Sakura Wars. We're moving on to the second chapter of the game. For the people, by the people, law? Is that what it is? Am I missing a word? I don't know. Let's see here. I'm excited. Oh boy. Ace Attorney, here we go. I was not expecting this. What's up, bud? Sorry, Mr. Sunnyside, you're, you're my boss. Mr. Sunnyside, are you serious? Absolutely. That would be a pretty lame joke, wouldn't it? Yeah, it'd be pretty awful, but then again, you... Starting today, you shall be the Star Division's official captain in training. For now, you've got plenty to learn from Ratchet and the rest of the team. Yes, sir. Uh, please teach me everything. I'll do whatever I can. So now, uh, please teach me everything. Let's be real excited for him. Please teach me everything. Good, good. Humility is very important to learning. Ratchet's a great teacher, so be ready. <laughs> well, I don't mind if she's a little harsh, since she's so pretty. <laughs> don't let her hear you talk like that. You'll be in for a very long speech. Oh, trust me, I already patted her head like an idiot. Yeah, I'm sure you're right. I better keep it a secret, huh? Boy, this main character is a dope and he's the best. It looks like you two are having fun. What's going on? Well, I told Shinny what we talked about and he happily accepted my request. He said he was very excited to get to learn under such a pretty teacher as yourself. How dare you? Mr. Sunnyside, why would you say that? Shin, you might still be in training, but you should really start acting like a captain. I know. Then take this more s I didn't even think that I was picking the wrong option there. Do you think you can just step right into my old job? No, sorry. To go along with this, Ratchet, I'd like you to become our vice commander from now on. Of course. R rank up. Here we go. Chapter 2. Of the people, for the people, by the people. Law. Dope. This city is home for all people's hopes and dreams. It's kind of a sanctuary. But it also attracts negative energy. Ambition, avarice, and hatred are enemies. Y you mean those robots and that giant enemy? That's right. So, Mr. Captain, do you have any questions? Well, I sh sure do. Yeah, where'd those robots come from? Where'd those robots come from? We're still looking into it, but we faced enemies like that before. It's not that unusual. Heck, we destroyed a whole bunch just before you arrived here. Really? Remember, Shin, it's our duty to investigate the sources of evil as well. I understand. Now then, do you have any more questions? Well, yeah, what, what do you mean by sanctuary? I mean, I know what the word means, but what do you mean? Go into more detail. What do you mean by sanctuary? Throughout human history, our civilizations are built on massive Numa centers. Are we just not going to learn what Numa is? Should I open up the enclosed instruction book and see if it explains Numa? Because we've gone this far and it has not actually explained what it is. Alright, I'm going to take a quick look into here. Let's see here. Um, where's the story section? Uh, looking for the word Numa. Looking for the word Numa. I don't see it on the first page that tells the story as I thought. Flow of the game, how to adventure, how to do all sorts of stuff, it tells me everything, there's apparently photography later on, oh my god, that's wild, I battle, 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 this is so huge, nope, there's actually nothing in here explaining what the Numa is, well, well, all right. Apparently, it says, I did see here, though. Use the passwords gained from the official Soccer Wars website, Nisa website, and Rosen Queen website on the screen for secret surprises. Rosen Queen is the company in um, Disgaea. I mean, I guess it's Kazek Seed. I wonder what those unlock. Anyways, what are Numa? Just like Tokyo and Paris, New York is built on land infused with lots of Numa. Because of this, the Numa attracts more people, more energy, and keeps on growing. Huh. Perhaps you've sensed it already, but New York has a certain allure for people. And it's not limited just to positive energy, it attracts hatred and evil as well. That's why the city needs a devoted anti-evil force to defend it. Us, in other words. What do you think? Pretty cool speech, right? 
I see. I had no idea New York was so significant. By the way, have you been using that little device I gave you the other day? Oh, this? Yeah, it's really handy. It's a watch and a phone. It can actually take photos as well. It's called the Cameratron. There we go. Hey, we get it. Cameratron? I had no idea. That's really cool. There might be times when you need to take some pictures for an investigation or something. I was inspired to create it thanks to a spy movie I saw. Oh, that's neat. So why don't you try taking a few test photos? Oh yeah, go ahead and take a picture of us. Okay, sure. By the way, do you know how to use the Camatron? If not, I'd be happy to show- Yes, please, well? Yes, please teach me, I need to know. Yes, please teach me. Great, first of all, just hold the Camatron up nice and steady. Oh, how's- How's the view, Shin Snap? Shin Snap? Can you see Ratchet and me? Um, no, actually, not at all. Ah, then just move the camera by pressing the left analog stick. The left analog stick? Okay. Oh. Wow. Oh, now I can see you. But I can't fit more than just one person in the frame. You can then press up and down uh, to change the distance. Up and down, huh? Oh, this is actually insane. And we have to go into focus? I'm um, sign side. You're both in frame, but it's out of focus. Oh, adjust your focus bar says the L and R buttons. Align the two circles together. Align the circles by pressing L1 and R1. Got it. Hey, why are you having so much trouble with the Camatron? Just press the L1. Oh, because I tried moving. There, now I can see you clearly. I mean, it could be a little bit more, but... Snap by pressing square. Alright, let's take a look and see what you've learned. Show me your best picture. Okay, so then... Trying to get them into focus. Oh, that's tough to get them perfectly in focus. Oh, boy. Wait, what if what if I perv it and see what he says? Yo, let's try it. I'm, I'm gonna see what happens. There's gotta be. I feel like this game must know, right? This game's one of those games where it's like, they'll, they'll do something. Okay, and shot. How's this? Do you like it? <laughs> so, uh, where are we? I don't see a hint of either of us in the picture. Well, no, but don't you think it's a nice photo anyway? Hmm, tough to say. What do you think, Ratchet? I'm a little disappointed. I thought you'd take this rare opportunity to get a nice photo. Sorry! Are we gonna have to do it again? Anyway, I have to get- Wow, nothing, huh? We have a little time before the show starts, so can I press, like, triangle or something at any time to do it? Oh, hey, there's that photo. Photo of Karen. That's a good photo still. Okay, well. Please get there on time. See you later, Captain in Training. Got it! Captain in Training. I have to prove myself and get... Do I press start to use it? I'm just trying other things. Nope. Maybe it is automatic and it's not just whenever you want. I have to prove myself and get everyone to recognize my ability. I can do it. I can show them all my samurai spirit. Oh, boy. Hey, Shinny. What's up? Did something good happen? Yeah, they made me captain in training. Isn't that incredible? Wow, really? You might be in training, but you're still Star Division Captain. That's great. Mighty impressive. Your uncle would be proud. What a quick promotion. Oh, Kayama. I didn't know you were here. I'm gonna work really hard. That's always a good thing. Why don't I take you somewhere nice to celebrate? Somewhere nice? Like where? In New York? There's nowhere nice. The Metropolitan Museum. I heard they have a Japan exhibit right now. I want to go too. Sounds like fun. Let's do it. Okay, then off we go. Great! That's a museum. Here we are, the New York Metropolitan Museum. It's pretty gigantic, huh? Is this really all one museum? It's huge. Yep, it takes a full week to see everything. <laughs> actually, this is the fourth time I've been here and I haven't even seen half of it. Wow, it seems like you can find anything in this great city. <laughs> is, this, is this secretly a New York uh, project to get people to come here? Bigger is better, right? Let's go. I hope you guys are ready for some marvels. <laughs> I sure am. What's this? It's the Egypt exhibit. 
Lots of mummies and things in here. Mummies, huh? It's my first time ever seeing one in person. It seems like New York takes pieces of the entire world and makes it their own. That's called colonization. But mummies are like really old, powerful people, right? Isn't it bad luck to hold them right here? Hmm, I think you're right. It's strange that Americans don't worry about it. Almost like Americans love stealing stuff from other countries and claiming it's their own, regardless of the history of what actually happened there. Hmm. Uh, sorry, I shouldn't have said anything. I'm ruining the mood. No, it's okay. I mean, what you said makes perfect sense. Oh, that's right. I forgot to say this earlier, so... Congratulations, Shinny, your captain in training. I'm so happy for you. Oh, thank you. I'm pretty happy about that. It's so amazing. I gotta say, I respect you a lot more now. You're my hero. You've given me hope that if I keep doing my best, I can join the Star Division too. Is that right? Well, Gemini... Um... I'm sure you can do it. I'm sure you can do it. I'm here for you. You mean it? You really think I can do it? Star Division? Boy, that'd just be great. Well, I became the captain in training, so I'm sure you can join the team. Yeah, that's true. If you can do it, it should be easy for me. Well, that's not what I meant, but sure. You have to have hope. Do your best, Gemini. Yeah, I will. Watch me rise to the top. Okay, let's be successful together. Hey, what are you two doing? The Japan exhibit is this way. Oh, uh, yeah, we're coming. Sword of Overlord. Yeah, I don't know about that being Japan, my dude. What? What's that? That is the centerpiece of the Japanese exhibit. The Demon Blade. I'm sorry, the what now? Demon Blade? It's as if I can feel an ancient aura radiating from it. What an amazing sword. I just love these Japanese swords. If I had me one of them. Gemini, are you lost in your own head again? Listen, Shinjiro. Japanese culture has become extremely popular. It's the hip thing. Anime is cool, as they say. There are lots of people who just don't understand what it means to be Japanese. This is so wild! You said you felt the aura of the Demon Blade. That's because it's the real deal. This dude looks like Apollo Justice, I just realized. What? Now that you're training as a captain, you must prove that you, too, are the real deal. I'm not exaggerating when I say the fate of Japan rests on your shoulders. Kayama. I will defend my samurai honor. Let's do that. I will defend my samurai honor. Just watch. I'll make you all proud. That's what I like to hear, my boy. This is exactly what your uncle saw in you. But you're not there quite yet. Keep getting better every day. Thank you. I will do whatever I can to contribute to Japan's bright future. But isn't it odd that such an important Japanese piece found its way to New York? I know what you mean. But the people of this great country are hungry for history. And money. And will take anything to get it. America is like a child by world standards. Immigrants came here looking for a fresh start. But sometimes it's good to bring along some familiar things, you know? Some history. The people here are just starting to realize that. Is that right? So now they want to collect all these historical artifacts and show them off. And that includes this powerful sword. You understand? I think so. You mean this... Uh, this... Fake fantasy sword. I need to fix my ringtone still. Can I can I can I do that right now? Ah, uh, there we go. Haha. -ha. Earth Warriors, that's what I want. Hey, what's that sound? It's coming from you, Shinjiro. Oh, it's my camera tron. I forgot I can act like a telephone. Hello, Lieutenant Taiga here. Oh, of course. I'll head back right now. Shall we get going then? You have to prepare for the performance, yes? Yep. Gemini, let's go. Hey, Gemini. Your Highness, 
You must drop your sword and escape before it's too late. She is just a massive weeb. And it's the best. I could never flee, Sanjuro. It is my duty to defend my family's land and honor. <laughs> Very well. If you refuse to go, then we shall ride together into hell. Oh, it's so cool, actually. Um, Chamini, I think you're daydreaming again. We have to get back to the theater. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> so it's getting around to showtime, huh? You're gonna get yourself in trouble someday, Gemini. But for now, I must return to my shop. I wonder if you can actually ever buy anything from him. Thank you so much for showing me around today, Kayama. Oh, don't mention it. I consider it my duty to educate today's youth. Well then, see you around. You two, Gemini, take care. I will. Thanks a bunch. Let me know when you guys do something like this again. Alright, Shinny, we should get going too. You're right. This is my first day as captain in training. I can't be late. Then why don't we have a race to the theater? Ready? Go. Yo, are we doing this? We doing the QTE for this? Okay, give me your best shot, Gemini. Aw, oh, there's no actual QTE. All right, I gotta get to clean the theater. Talk to you later. See you around. Now that it's official, I should go tell everyone that I'm the new captain in training. Oh, hey, Tiger. Could you help me out real quick? Uh, I need some help, too. Huh? Both of you need help? Well, I guess I can tell them after tonight's performance. What are you doing? Hurry, hurry. We don't have time. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. I I just can't get over that one shot of the lips from the, the mecha sequence where it, it does the all face. It's a bit strange, but I'll take it. Oh, is that it? We over already? Is it still the same showing? Whew, today was really busy, but the audience seemed really pleased. Now I can tell everyone about me becoming captain in training. But what's the best way to bring it up? They're going to be so surprised. What's going on, Shinjiro? You look very... upbeat. Actually, I have some big news. Is Karen around? She's in the green room. Okay, then can you come with me to the green room? Oh, boy! We're off to a rollicking start. Who's there, Shin? Hua! Were you changing? Get your scrawny ass out of here before I call the police. Um. <laughs> I didn't know you are changing. I'm the new captain in training. I'm the new captain in training. I just want to tell everyone about it. Well, tell me later, would ya? Now is obviously not the time. Okay. <laughs> Yikes. <sighs> that was surprising. I didn't bring up the mark because I'm sure... That would be bad. Why is that? It only makes sense that she would change after the show. If you knew she'd be in there, why didn't you say anything? You didn't ask if she was changing. You only asked where she was. Well, yeah, but... <laughs> um... Karen. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you can, you say can and will be used against you. You have the right to an attorney. Do you understand these rights? If so, go ahead. Um, no, I'm okay. A wise decision. Subaru, you're a witness. You saw him spying on me while I was changing, right? I can't be sure of what I saw. What about you, Shinjiro? It was all a misunderstanding. I didn't intend to see anything. Very well, let's hold your trial right now. Subaru, you can serve as judge and jury. Very well, then go ahead with your opening statement, Karen. The defendant snuck into the green room while I was changing with no notification whatsoever. This did me considerable mental harm. I demand the defendant testify what was said then. Your statement has been heard and accepted. Mr. Taiga, what do you say at this point? Well... New captain in training! I said I'm the new captain in training. That's right! Despite me asking him to leave, he did not. Instead, he remained to make this comment. It sounds like you weren't thinking at all, Shinjiro. I can't say I'm surprised. He didn't even apologize. What excuse could he possibly have for that? 
I just, I just wanted to be given your captain in training. That's no excuse. I will report this to Commander Sunnyside, then I will take legal action. What? That's... Karen, Shindro seems truly sorry for what he did. Can you really not forgive him? Well, if that's how you feel, Subaru, then maybe I won't file the report just yet. I'm really sorry, Karen. Thank you, Subaru. So then... Do you have something to say to me? You better make it quick. I wanted to talk to you about what my plans are for the team right now. Request denied. Working hours are finished and overtime is not in my contract. Co contract? But we're supposed to defend the city. What does a contract matter? Contracts, agreements, and laws are everything here. Try to force me and you're screwed. Shinjiro Taiga, you really must take more time to learn the inner workings of our country. What? You sound really ridiculous right now. Say, Karen, don't you have a meeting with an important client soon? That's right. She's probably waiting for me right now. I have to go. Goodbye. If you screw up like this again, I wouldn't even think twice about hauling you into court. Boy, an American threatening a lawsuit, right? Like, in, in a regular everyday encounter? Yep. This is New York. Karen! I should get going too. I warn against any thoughtless actions in the future. Subaru, I... I'm the new captain in training. <laughs> I'm the new captain in training. I am aware. You told us earlier, remember? So what? Well, so... Nothing's going to change. I'll perform my own duties. No more, no less. Titles and positions mean nothing to me. All that matters is your ability. Subaru warns you that everything depends on your performance in battle. Okay, thank you. In that case, I'm going home. Goodbye. I'm the captain in training. I'm exhausted. Maybe I should head home and get some sleep. Okay, I've checked to make sure all the doors and windows are locked. Time to head home. Mr. Tiger, might I ask you for a favor? Why, uh... Please don't sneak up on me like that. What is Wagya again? My apologies. Could you please deliver this envelope to Miss Archer's law office? Oh boy. The letter came here for her, but it seems she already left for the day. I do believe this letter is extremely urgent, so you must deliver it today in person. So you want me to deliver it to her myself? I'm not sure that's a good idea, but... It's fine, it's fine. Her office is over in Harlem. Like the Globetrotters? Hmm. Well, I wanted to talk about, talk to her. Uh, I wanted to talk to her about earlier and defend myself a little more. Anyway, good, good. Thank you. I really appreciate your help. All right, this will. I'm gonna walk in and she's gonna be dressing again. Karen's law office is in Harlem, huh? All right, I better get going. Let's globe trot, boys. I don't know anything about Harlem beside the Harlem globe trotters. I don't even know what Harlem is. Guys, I'm not American. Like, these things are Americans who'd be like, Oh, you don't know Harlem? You don't know Manhattan is part of New York? It's like, no. This place doesn't seem too safe. Where's her office anyway? Let's just get this over with so I can go home already. Is her office somewhere around here? Man, the buildings around here are in really bad shape. A lot of them look abandoned. Huh? Oh! Why, uh, jeez, what did I do? Hey, what's going on? How'd he get in here? The lookout must have fallen asleep again. What is this accent you have? Is it meant to be Hispanic? If so, you're failing. You know where you are, kid? This is Harlem, dig? What are you doing here? I am a foreigner who is lost. I'm just here to deliver a package to Karen. Karen? There ain't no Karen here. Why don't you just get lost? I'm trying. Uh, but I was told she had her office here in Harlem. Scram, punk. Your kind ain't allowed on our turf. That's pretty racist. Yeah, that's a good idea. Like, why can't you just be like, sorry, I'm in the wrong place. Don't worry, you go about your business. That was close. <laughs> Looks like I can't even step foot in Harlem. What should I do? Should I go back and talk to Mr. Wong? Oh, what are you doing here, Shin? Were you just running or something? Yeah, actually, I just ran here from the entrance to Harlem. 
Wow, you must be real tired. What are you doing around Harlem at this time of night? I have to drop off this letter at Karen's office, but some punks chased me out. I see. Yeah, the people in Harlem are pretty suspicious of strangers. If you need to go to Harlem, you should get someone familiar with the area to go with you. Uh, that's a good idea. I should try doing that. Well, anyway, I still have some work back to do at the office, at the theater. Good luck, Shin. Oh, you're not helping me. Awesome, great. So who? All right, I should try to find someone on their way to Harlem. Uh, so whom could that be? Well, let's go... Not here, because they're going to be... At... We want someone out and about on their way to Harlem. Whoa. Tagger, hold on a minute. Hi. You have a Camertron, right? Well, yeah, why? It's about time for us to update the theater program, and there's a section where we feature specific staff members. And we need photos that show off the theme for the program. Do you think it could help? So you just need photos for the program? Sounds like fun. Great. So then, do you want the details? Well, uh, yes, please. Yeah, please. Okay, we need pictures that make good background scenery for the featured staff members. We don't want pictures of people, just the backgrounds themselves. Remember that. Okay, just walk around New York and if you find a good shot, hit the triangle button and select camera. Got it? And if you just take the photo, and just take the photo however you want. But make sure your composition really highlights the area's unique characteristics. And no photos of the theater. We have plenty of those, so go somewhere else. And no dark photos. If you take photos at night, make sure there's a good light source. If you mess up, you can retry as many times as you want. But you can only submit the last photo you've taken. Got it? This is a crazy feature. I think so. So if you want to take a nice picture, make sure you bring it to the bar right away. And by the way, the featured staff member for this program is Gemini Sunrise. So I'd go visit the places Gemini likes the most. Places Gemini likes the most. Got it. Well, the museum. And one more thing. You can check the current theme by listening to the radio. The featured member will change each month, so make sure to check it out. And that's it. Bring me a great photo, and I'll give you a fantastic reward. Good luck, Tiger. Okay, interesting. Hi, can I get another photo? Can I get another photo, please? Hi, Shin. What are you doing here so late? The shop's closed down. If you want to buy something, hurry up. Okay. I want to buy a photograph. Uh, can I get some photos? Do you really want it? Alright, I'll make an exception this one time. Wait, well, go ahead and pick one of these Star Division photos. Wait, so I can get all three, I guess, by the end. Okay, then we'll get... That's a photo of Ratchet. Is that what you want? Sure, we'll grab it this time. Are you sure that you want Ratchet's photo? She's easily the best actress here. People all over the world special order her photos. Anyway, that'll be 50 cents. Thank you for your business. Cool. Can I buy another one? Can I just buy them all? Uh, can I get some photos? Hey, don't be so greedy. I can only sell one at a time. Okay, we have to leave some for the customers. Oh, okay. And we'll talk to you this time. Get that relationship points up. Huh? Shin, did you know the button on your vest is about to fall off? Huh? Oh, you're right. You're an usher, right? So all kinds of people see you. You have to be more careful. Here, let me fix it for you. I'm pretty good with the needle. And I'm sure you don't know how to sew, right? You're way too clumsy. Uh... That's really nice of you. Could you... Uh... I'm gonna be, be just regular with it. Could you? I'd like that. Could you? I'd like that. You're right. I have no idea how to fix it. <laughs> well, at least you're honest. Alright, take off the vest and hand it over. You just get rid of the old thread, get some new thread and sew it up and done. Thanks, Henri. You're awesome. Oh, well, there we go. See ya. It's probably another conversation, but... Yeah, goodbye, Shin. So at least she's warming up to us a bit. Um, okay. Oh, wait, there's the bar, too. Let's actually go check out what's going on in the bar, because we haven't actually talked to her over at the bar. Let's see what there is. Hi. Hey, uh, did you take a good photo for Gemini? If so, let me take a look. Okay. Um, about the photo's theme. Let's see, what is it again? It's just for Gemini. What's the theme for the photo? It's the perfect backdrop for Ge uh, Gemini. Your best visit or favorite shops. Alright, let's see what I can do. 
Oh, her shops. Okay, well that that means we go to Ramondo. Let's talk to you, Cherry. Have you ever heard, have you ever had soft serve ice cream? I just love how cool and sweet it is. It's probably my favorite dessert treat. I rented this new machine that makes soft serve ice cream all on its own. Oh really? Does it work? Yeah, it's kind of tricky though. You have to hold the cone and turn it to get a nice spiral. Wow, that's really cool. Would you like to try? Maybe you can maybe you can show me a few tricks. Okay, let me turn on the machine and you just rotate the cone, okay? Okay, we're going to actually have to rotate. Whoop. This is crazy. Oh, we got mostly up. I need to go faster. How's this? Oh, wow. That's a perfect spiral. It's like a unicorn horn. I learned a lot just now. Thanks, tiger. You're welcome. I'm just glad I could help. Cool. Neat little events with Cherry and Henri. I should get going. I have to deliver something to Karen's office. Oh, right now? Okay, have fun. She's really less flirty than her initial confrontation took her to be for me. Well, let's go to Midtown, because we're going to go check out Romandos. This Subaru just chilling. Hey, Subaru, let's talk. Let's actually have a Subaru event right now. Subaru, what are you doing in the front of the hotel? Subaru is awaiting a limousine. What's a limousine? It's kind of a really fancy taxi. I'm heading to the Mercury Club in Harlem. Oh, you're heading to Harlem? Indeed, why? Are you heading that way as well? If so, you can catch a ride with me. Harlem can be a pretty dangerous place. I can show you around if you like. Oh yeah, well... Um, I'm gonna say no, that's okay for now, because eh, I want to go get the picture. No, it's okay, I don't want to inconvenience you. Well, do as you wish. Oh, is she actually gonna leave? The limousine is here, I'll be get- Oh no! Oh no, did I screw up? Can we take Gemini around uh, along with us? Because that would- That'd be a, a show and a half to see that go around. Hey, Romando. Good evening, Shinjiro. What can I do for you? So I'm pressing triangle. It's not letting me. Well, talk to Kayama. Uh, by the way, your friend, the lawyer, Karen, right? I hear she's a corporate attorney for some big time local company. Corporate attorney? It's sort of like uh, the legal version of a personal medical doctor. I was reading the paper the other day and saw an article about her in it. Deadline was something like New York's best lawyer? It's good that the Star Division is a uh, talented, such a talented individual amongst the ranks. You're right. So I'm actually gonna leave, and then maybe do I have to be outside and press triangle to do it? I should get going now. Good night, and then get some sleep, okay. Okay, so let's go camera. I should be able to take some good pictures here. Okay, so stop taking photographs, because this is not what we want. So I want to be inside and take it. I guess he can't... I guess he can't actually take him inside. Okay. So they want it in the... Oh! Mr. Tiger! Why, uh? Sorry, but I thought you might be getting... So I followed you. Trouble getting... Trying to get in the Harlem Lobby to take the liberty of... Oh, okay. Interesting. You mean it? Thanks. Not at all. Shall we go then? So I screwed up, meaning that I should have gone with a girl. But because I took too much time... Or said no to Subaru. This happened. This is Harlem. Miss uh, Archer's office is on this street. Thanks again. You really saved me here. I'm really sorry. You asked me to do this for you in the first place, but here you are anyway. Eh, no worries, young sir. All that matters is that you must deliver the envelope to Miss Archer yourself. I see. Well, I should be getting back. Take care of yourself, Mr. Tiger. Mr. Wong, did you do this just to give me an excuse to talk to Karen? Well, either way, I should get going. This is my first time being here. Maybe I should walk around before I see Karen. Okay, so we got the Mercury Club. Oh, that's where um, Subaru went. Hi, Subaru. How was the jazz music? It was my first experience listening to live jazz like that. I've come to understand the fundamentals of its rhythm, cadence, and melody. Really? That's pretty amazing. Well, it's music, after all. 
And like music, it's based on a series of patterns and connections. Once you understand those patterns, you can manipulate them and become a jazz master. Subaru is sure she could play better than anyone here given a certain amount of time. That'd be great! I'd love to hear you play! Hmm, perhaps if I get a chance. Now that Subaru's gone, I should head to Karen's office and deliver this envelope. There's a laundromat. Oh, this is the l office? Doesn't look like it. So Karen's office is in here. Alright, time to deliver the envelope. Deliver it now. Let's go. I need to do this now. She might already be in trouble. Well then, I'd better head in. All right. Well, uh, because we're giving a nice stopgap here, uh, next time, guys, we'll continue with some more Sakura Wars, So Long My Love, where we go check in with Karen, see what's going on, see if she truly actually uh, is uh, is in trouble, uh, or if this is just going to lead to more shenanigans. I'm betting the latter. We'll see you all for some more next time, guys. I like to leave by hitting the discontinue button because it leads to a cool fade out. So uh, we're going to say go to title. Ciao, guys.